left our heroes. The two of their they uh, went to a mysterious necropolis following their fearful friend, Mr. Twinkleton, to acquire a mysterious treasure which turned out to be a mysterious map, or a piece of the map. And they also went into Lord Soft, which seems to also want something from Mr. Twinkleton. And no reason, no explanation how he knows about Mr. Twinkleton or how he acquired the map. Uh, oh, and we uh, got some new characters, uh, players uh, for this party, starting with uh, Draglin, the, the Blue Draconian. you know Shia well not her name but I have their name in here too Tyrell Lucho Duck that's all it is in Dark Ages it's a weird name with Duck at the end of it but everyone just calls him Duck of course he I changed the image, but it's our barbarian seeking revenge. And that should be your party for this uh, session. We have a fighter, a ranger, a ranger, a wizard, uh, the psionic. to get, receive the robes of sorcery, an initiate robes. Now, we are to earn black robes. Duck went, went to uh, take the child from the Jingers at the time of, at this tower of uh, the black one. himself, he uh, took his trials, ended up as mysterious and strangely enough as a red rope wizard, and he became an illusionist. While Shia also took her test, she received her mysterious, uh, mysterious during her test, she found a room that no one can see, received a mysterious artifact known as the Staff of Magius and the Silver Dagger of Magius. And it was greeted by a mysterious man who identified him for him as this man. No one knows how she acquired them or how they fell into this place and into her hands. That there's a greater hand of fate in store for her. She received her white robe with her, which she wanted, and became a the unearthed Arcana Thurgy. Is that how you say it? Wizard. So she's choosing the light domain. Story began with them taking the test, they passed the trials, and now they're staying at the Black Mountain. And staying in their dorms, taking a long rest, 
brought this beast upon us. How could you? Oh, you stupid boy. You stupid, stupid boy. And all I think and the parents of the boy is like, you have to hey, help us find this kid. We have to kill it so he can so he can come out. And the parents are like, we can't. We literally can't. And the beast is dangerous. And the boy is like, you're right. And they were right. Red Moon would never hurt anyone. Red Moon means fear. party was split in half. Some believed the boy was the beast, which turned out to be an owlbear. The others I believed the, the people Well, they didn't believe it. The, they, the people exclaimed it was an owlbear. I should clarify. They exclaimed they were sure it was an owlbear because the boy was keeping us in some animal, animal companion in the Keystone Forest at the time. But the, the you know, half the party weren't convinced because they saw teeth marks, not beak marks. So I just led to a few questions within the party. Some believed it was the owl bear. Some believed it was the after him, followed by Pyra and the sun. And while the other party is was uh, speaking with the townspeople about the incident, they encounter a man named Mr. Willington, who is very certain that this is now bare offers a reward to the players if they bring back the carcass of the owlbear. And Duck, being excited as all uh, like most monarchs, is eager to bring him a carcass of an owlbear. sorts of tracks and something humanoid was on the tracks. And they are as they're moving uh, following tracks, they're agreed by a mysterious sort of or mysterious sort of figure who uh, wish they're just passing on their way decide to decide to uh, to encourage them to uh, wish them well on their hunt for the owlbear. Now the as they leave the psionic decides to do something rather, well, I like to say ridiculous, and insult the mysterious, uh, insult the uh, mysterious uh, uh, pa uh, pedestrians, mysterious travelers to this forest, and um, calling them idiots and calling them stupid. As they walk away, one runs up, grabs him by the throat, revealing a claw hand, and, and he fails his strength. 
subject, so he is uh, strangled, being bifurcated by this hand of this creature. And when they're during the fight, uh, they're and when the, the the woman is brought to them, there he it reveals that these are indeed draconian. Here's the thing, draconians have not been seen in a long time, not in centuries and millennia. So to see draconians is is a sort of like an ill omen of things to come. So they get in this big fight and the draconians die and they say, Well, I can't do much because he's grappled.
wants to shoot the cultist that is L3 sneak ahead shot kills the cultist instantly but then they hear a great war to reveal to reveal a white dragon wormling now this is a wormling not a full adult dragon or a young dragon this is a wormling and they band together like yeah, we can take this one playing this fine and whoosh, a second one
turns out that he killed the, accidentally killed a man in a wrestling match, and the noble woman 